I will show you how you can auto DM anyone who follows your Instagram account and turn new followers into real growth for your business. And we will create it in three simple steps. I will show you what tool you need, how to set it up for your Instagram and the best strategy to use this without being spammy. I've been creating DM automations for over six years, generated 150,000 leads and over $50,000 in direct sales for my clients. So by the end of this video, you will know how to use this feature the right way and grow your business. And you will get my template for free so that you can get started today. Let's dive in. So the first step that you need to do is create a free ManyChat account. And ManyChat is one of the best DM automation platforms in the world. And I use them all the time for my own clients. And I use ManyChat because it's easy to use, 100% meta approved and very cheap. They offer a free plan and their pro plan already starts at $15 a month. So what you can do is you can just go to the link in the description and there you will find my link and will find my discount code that will give you 30 days of the pro plan for free. And full disclaimer, this is an affiliate link, but it doesn't have any influence on the price you pay. And it definitely helps me with creating free videos like these. So you can just go to the link in the description or you can just go to chatomize.com slash MC and this will bring you directly to the ManyChat website. And then here you can just click on get started and then click on Instagram and then you can connect your Instagram account to ManyChat. And I actually have a separate video on my YouTube channel that explains how you can connect your Instagram account to ManyChat. So after you have watched this video, I highly recommend going to that video as well. I already have a ManyChat account, so I would just click here on sign in and then click on sign in with Facebook. So now I am in ManyChat and then in order to set this up, you need to go to settings and I need to go to Instagram. And then if you scroll down, then here you can see say hi to new followers. And then we have two ways of setting it up. So I will show you both ways. The first one is to set it up quickly. And this is what ManyJet calls a quick automation. The first time you click on setup, ManyJet actually asks you for more permissions. So then a pop-up will come up and it basically asks you, okay, can we get more permissions in order to do this? You can just give those permissions. You need to go to Facebook, give the permissions, and then you come back here and then you can set it up. So when you click on this, you can basically determine how you want to set it up. So you can set it up when someone new follows you, you can automatically reply after 30 seconds, one minute, five minutes, 10 minutes, or you can do it right when they do it, right? So I would say no delay, and then they will either get an opening DM like this, and then ManyChat already prompts you with a message that you can send. So they say, hey there, thank you for following me, want to check it out, and then you can give them something, or you can send them a DM asking for their email, right? So then we can add an opening DM and we ask for their email, for example, to send them a freebie. So when you click on this, then it sends an opening DM, a DM asking for their email, and then once you've got their email, then you can send them a DM with a link. And then also if they don't reply with that, you can also send a follow-up DM if they don't click the link. So you can set it up like this, and this will allow you to either send just a very basic DM saying that, hey, thank you for the follow, or you can set it up so that you send a DM and you directly ask for their email, for example, in return for a freebie or something like that. But to be honest, I wouldn't use it like this because I know that most people are using this to either send a link to a landing page or to ask someone right away for their email. But that just comes off as super spammy. Like that's not a strategy, that's just annoying. So instead of doing this, what I recommend you to do is ask a question. And more specifically, you should ask a question that helps you understand what the follower actually needs. Because if you can better understand the goals of your follower, you can better understand what they try to achieve and you can give away free value. And when you give away free value, you build trust with your audience. And when you build trust, that's what turns a follower into a lead and a lead into a customer. So let me show you how I would set this up. Let's say you are a fitness coach and someone starts following you on Instagram. So instead of directly sending them to a landing page or asking for their email, we can just ask a simple question. We can basically ask, okay, do you want to build more muscle, lose fat, or look more toned? And then based on what they answer to us, we can either give them a free guide, a link to a podcast episode, or an Instagram reel that is specifically tailored to what they just answered. And this is simple, helpful, and tailored to what they actually need. So let me show you how I set it up in ManyChat. So what we can do here is I would just enable this opening DM. So we can basically set this live. So I would just put in something here and then click on go live. And then instead of doing this, we can actually click here on switch to flow builder. 
So we click there. And then for now, I will just disable this. Now we're building this. And then in this first message, we don't want to add this button. So we can basically remove all of this. And then I will add my first message. So here we'll say, hey, thanks for the follow. I got a few free things that might help you. Quick question, what is your number one fitness goal right now? Lose fat, build muscle or look more toned. Just click a button below or reply with a number. And then we can add three quick replies. So I will add one with one, we'll add one with two, and we'll add one with three, right? So that's basically how we set it up. And then if they reply with any of those, we can send them the next message, right? So I would just connect these to next messages. We'll do it a bit like this and then set it up like this. Right. So let me quickly explain why we're doing it with one, two, three. Like these things are called quick replies. And these are like buttons that people can click on in the Instagram DM. But the problem is these quick replies are not shown on Instagram desktop. So you can only see them on Instagram mobile. So if someone is on Instagram mobile, they can just click on one, two, or three. But if they are on desktop, then they can just type in a one or can type in a two or type in a three. And then they can also continue with the rest of the funnel. So that's basically why we set it up like this, is that then whether you are on Instagram desktop or you're on Instagram mobile, it will always work. So now we can set up the rest of the flow. So we're going to set it up that if someone wants to lose fat, we're going to ask for their name and ask for their email. And then we are going to deliver that right in the DMs. If they say they want to build more muscle, then we say we have a podcast episode for them and just link to the podcast episode. And if they want to say that they look more toned, then we actually have an Instagram reel. And this shows you that you don't necessarily necessarily always need to convert them directly into a lead only if you have something for them that actually makes sense and that is the case with losing the fat but if you only for example have a podcast episode or just a reel on your instagram you can just link to that and that shows you you can just help them in the best way possible depending on what their answer is so let's get started with the first one so in this first message we can say awesome i've got a free five-step ebook that breaks down exactly how to lose fat the smart way just two simple steps to get you x and then we can add a simple delay. So we will wait for three seconds and then we can add a data collection element. So a data collection element in ManyChat is a way where we can get data from someone and then store that into a field in ManyChat. And in this case, we want to ask for someone's first name. So what we can do here is we can just ask a simple question saying, what is your first name? Just type it in below. And then the reply type will be first name so that when someone answers this question, it will be automatically saved in the first name field in ManyChat. And we set the data collection expires to 23 hours. So people have 23 hours to reply to this message. And we remove the skip button text so they cannot skip this question, right? So we can just remove this and that is working correctly. So now we say, okay, what is awesome. We got a free ebook. What is your name? And then we can connect that to the next message. So in this next message, we can directly use their name in this message. So here we can say, nice to meet you. And then you can either just type in a bracket or you can click here on the bracket and then say first name. And then we say, nice to meet you, first name. Again, we will add a quick delay. And then we can add another data collection element. And here's when we're going to ask for their email. So then we can say, and on what email do you want to receive my free ebook? Just type in your email below. And what's very important with this is that you set the reply type to email. Oh, that's over here. And that will make sure that if someone replies to this question and the answer that they give is not an email, ManyChat will automatically send this retry message. So it will say, please enter a correct email address. And we will also set the data collection expires to 23 hours. So people have 23 hours to reply to this question and we will again remove the skip button text. So that's it. And then once they give their email, uh, then we will just give them the thing uh, that we're going to give to them, which is the free ebook in this case. And then we can add a button with get free ebook. So we can say, thank you. Just click the button below to get my free ebook. And this will go to a website where you have hosted your free ebook. This could be a Google Drive. This could be a just your normal website. I will just type in my website. Um, but that's what you basically need to put in there, right? And what's also good to know with ManyChat, yeah, we need to set up these other messages as well. Uh, what's also good to know is that when you get someone's email in ManyChat, what you can do is add an action on reply. 
And then you can actually send that email, for example, to your email marketing platform or to a Google Sheet where you can have like your collection. And it's very good because then you can automatically build your email list with ManyChat as well. So when you connect that, for example, it just comes over here. So here you can just add Google Sheet and then insert row, and then it will do that like that. If you want to set it up with your email marketing platform, the only thing you need to do is go to settings in ManyChat, then go to integrations, and then you can see all the integrations that ManyChat has. So it has Flowdesk, for example, it has Hotmart, it has uh, ActiveCampaign, MailChimp. And once you connect like your ManyChat account, for example, to MailChimp over here, then the action will appear here on the left side and you can actually add the email from ManyChat automatically to MailChimp or ActiveCampaign or Clavio, whatever you're using. So it's good to know that like you can automatically build your email list as well. So that's kind of the first route. So if they want to lose fat, we give them a free ebook. And then if they want to build more muscle, that's basically when we're going to give them a podcast episode right so in this message we will say got it i actually just recorded a podcast episode on building muscle faster just click the button below to listen and then here you can just add a button that goes to a website and then the button title is listen to the podcast and this can go to for example spotify or apple podcast i will just type in my own uh, website name right now uh, but just know that you can just put in the podcast episode right there so that's how basically how you can do that and then if they go with looking more toned, then what we are going to send is just a link to an Instagram reel because we have an Instagram reel on looking more toned. So that's what we do. We go here, we say, got you. Here's a quick Instagram reel that breaks down how to get that tone look. And then here we can again add a button uh, which says watch the reel. And then here it goes to open the website and normally this will go to Instagram. So you can just type in instagram.com slash and then the link basically going to the reel. So that's basically how you set it up. And then you can just click here on updates and now that is working and you just need to make sure that here you have user follows your account and when you want to set the delay automation. So you can wait zero seconds, you can wait for one minute, five minutes, 10 minutes. It's basically how you want to do it. Uh, I just want to do it after zero seconds, but if you want to let it feel basically like a human, want to wait like five or 10 minutes before you actually do that. But that's basically how you set it up. Let me show you now how this works on Instagram. So now I am on Instagram and then if I click on follow, you see that I get an automatic DM with, hey, thanks for the follow. I got a few free things that might help you. Quick question, what is your number one fitness goal right now? And then if I reply with one, then it says, awesome, I've got a free five-step ebook that breaks down exactly how to lose fat. What is your first name? So then I type in my first name. Then it says, nice to meet you, Joran. And on what email do you want to receive my free ebook? So then I type in my email. And then it says, thank you. Just click the button below to get my free ebook. And that's how you set it up. So if you want to get started with this right now, you can just join my free school community and get my free template. So you can either go to the link in the description or you can go to chatomize.com slash school and that will bring you directly to my school community. Here you can sign up for free. And then once you are in, you can just go to classroom, go to the free many chat templates. And then here you have auto DM who follows your Instagram account. And then when you click on this, it will go to your ManyChat template and you can install it with just one simple step. But that's it. That's how you can auto DM anyone who starts following your Instagram account. But this is just the start. If you also want to auto DM anyone who comments on your Instagram post, please check out this video.